Hey guys, Hydrox8 here and welcome to Off The Runway where we look at the true endgame that is Fashion Frame and this week we are looking at a frame that causes a rift in the community, it is Limbo. So as you can see behind me we have the Bard frame, um, but that is also some pictures alongside the ones from I took from 10 VIP. So you can see me and some of the community team, thank you so much for coming. I absolutely loved meeting everyone that actually came up and talked to me. Um, I also think that Frozen Balls and Inglorious Bee have a vlog, which you can see me eating because that's all I seem to do in these things. Um, but yeah, so I emailed all the winners of the 3k sub giveaway. You have your platinum codes in your email, so go check it. Otherwise, you didn't get it, and I'm sorry, but we'll have some in the future. So without further ado, let's get on with the looks. And now, as always, we are starting with my look. So this is the one I use in game currently. As you can see, blue, white, and gold for the metallic parts. And for attachments, we have the Rave Elite armor all around, which you can get from the PvP Conclave. And then we have the Nazaru sign down on the back, which is a Tenogen item from Master Noob. And our next look. So we're going for a bit lighter of a look here. So we have white, blues, and oranges. As for attachments, you see we have the Prism Daedalus all around. And on the back, we have the Ormulu Chiroptera sign down. And now we're going for more of like a royal look here, so that's why we're using these kind of stony and nude tones. As you can see, the Acanthus Prime armor all around and the Isvara sign down on the back completes the look lovely with the textures of their actual pieces. And now our next look is kind of more of the lotus, but with a pop of color, that's why the purple and orange work very well together here. As you can see, we have the Prism Edo armor all around and the Imperator sign down on the back. You better cover yourself because this next look is called the Red Rocket look, so that's why we're using the Sky Thin on the back, which is from Master Noob, another Tenogen item, and we have the Porta armor all around. And now when rapiers and fashion meets, this is what we have. We have in the Avant on guard look. So we're using bright, bright orange and some lovely little tones of blue just to tie it all together. We have the Uro Prime on the back and then the Eos Prime armor all around. And this is kind of taking inspiration from the phase skins for Vauban. So instead of going to Rift, we're getting phased by Void Energy. So we're using kind of like... They're more like minty green tones, but they're a little bit off than that. Um, but we have the Dendra armor all around, but we have the Prisma Daedalus on the chest, and then we have the Phase Acid sign down on the back, which you can get from the Steam Market. And our last look. So this is the Orican Court look. So I'm kind of looking for like an Orican Jester slash Magician here, and that's why I'm using these tones and these things you see in the Orican palette, and one's very similar to it. But we have the Katir Dyak sign down on the back, and then the Halter armor all around. As always guys, thank you so much for watching, like, comment, subscribe, we do videos every week. I am very busy recording this week because we have to do our parent sequence video for Thursday and then for Saturday I'm going to have an actual operator fashion so we can get ready for the war within. So, I will see you soon and take care.